Four and the Texas League Championship Series will be decided in a little over maybe 12, 11 hours with the Arkansas Travs playing in a must-win game tonight. It's going to be a lot of fun. Travs beat Midland last night in Game 2 to force Game 3. Lucky for us, our good luck charm is back at Dickey <laughs> Stevens Park. Michaela Johnson ready to rock and roll. We're very excited and hopefully going to see a little history tonight in Argenta. Michaela. Hey there, Hayden and Karen. That's right. We're super excited because they won that must win game two, forced this game three. So we're hoping we're going to get a win tonight, but we're not. We're not jinxing. We're a good luck charm. We're bringing all of the excitement and energy. And I have Sophie Osier, the general manager of the Arkansas Travelers here with us this morning. Thank you for waking up early after a late night. And so just for people who are joining us this morning, tell us about some highlights from last night. What are some big things that you noticed at the game? Yeah, so obviously a do or die situation for us last night and the Travs were able to pull it through. And I think a huge component of that was the fact that we had a lot of people here. People were loud, people were intense. Um, they created a real playoff environment for these guys. And so we need to do it one more time. One more time, it's another ask. And we're asking everybody to come out here and wear red. We've got Logan Evans on the mound tonight. He's gonna be wearing his red jersey. Um, and so he asked for a red out. So uh, asking everybody that comes to the ballpark tonight to make sure they bring their red. Absolutely. And so talk to me about the importance of this game. So you, the one for what it means for the season and then also what it means for the ball club. Yeah, so this will be the first Texas League championship. If we win tonight, it'll be the first championship since 2008. Um, and past that, this will be the first time since at least the 80s that we would win at home. Um, so a really, really unique opportunity. Obviously, we had a chance last year uh, while we were on the road and played a game three Texas League championship series last year. And so really hoping that we can bring it home tonight. Obviously, a big series. And we went to game three last week while we are up in Springfield for the divisional round. So hoping that the guys can pull it through tonight. Absolutely. And so why should the fans come out today where they're red? Tell why should people come through those gates? I mean, last night was a really intense game. The Travs ended up scoring early, went up one to zero. Midland came back, tied it at one, and then kind of late in the game, um, the fans got really into it. We were able to score two runs, and then we were kind of able to hold them for the last two and a half innings. Um, so I really think that that environment and that atmosphere has so much to do with our guys and being able to keep that intensity and stay locked in during the game. So um, obvious this, obviously with this being a deciding game for their season, and this is 100% going to be our last game at Dickey Stevens for the 2024 season season. We want to make sure we pack this place out and create a good environment for them. Absolutely. And so finally, just where can people get tickets? Yeah, so always head over to Travs.com. We recommend getting your tickets in advance. Our tickets start at $7, so you can watch history potentially being made for $7. Just can't beat that anywhere in town. Um, but obviously, you go to Travs.com, get your tickets in advance, or you can always come to the box office and get them in person for game day. Absolutely. We're so excited. Game three tonight, first pitch, $6.35, $7 to start. So come out, wear your red, and cheer on the traps guys reporting live from Dickie Stevens. I'm going to go ahead and send it back to you. Let's go. So excited. Michaela. <laughs> thank you so much. Oh, pumped up for tonight. She is their good luck mm. charm. I think you should probably stick around 630 Michaela PM. Mm. That's not a problem, is it? Mm -hmm. <laughs>